Hi guys, I'm David with Media Unlock Tech, and today we're going to be showing you how to do some upgrades to your MacBook Pros, which are going to be pretty awesome. So I recently bought a 13-inch 2012 mid MacBook Pro. Uh, it has the 2.9 i7 core processor in it as well. It has a 500 gig, 5400 RPM hard drive, which is really slow for me. And it has an optical drive, which I do not need anymore um, on this laptop. So the theory is, is to upgrade this laptop and take the optical or CD drive out of this and put it into my MacBook Pro 2009 unibody. So pretty much most of the components that you'll find in the 2012, pretty much from the 2009, early 2009 to mid 2012 was when they, the last time they made this, this uh, thicker unibody, unibody before they went to the retina display. So uh, pretty much the components are pretty interchangeable. So we're going to be making uh, quite a few different videos um, and there will be links at the end of this video to all of those videos. So here are the videos that we are going to be doing for you guys here at Media Unlock Tech. So we will be taking the CD drive out of here and we will be replacing the broken CD drive in here and we'll be putting it in there. And then what we will be doing is taking, uh, taking um, my components here. So I have a a solid state hard drive by Samsung, 250 gigs, it's the 840 Evo. Now this is a pretty nice, uh, pretty nice SSD, it's 250, it's about $140. Now this is, the, this is the one that only comes with the hard drive itself, it doesn't come with any of the other components. So to, to be able to do a cloning, and we will be showing you how to actually clone the Samsung hard drive with the software so you're actually able to clone, I'll be able to clone the exact OS off of this onto my Samsung hard drive and then that will allow me to uh, have my SSD as my, main, as my main hard drive allowing this computer to run a lot faster um, as well. So we'll be showing you how to install the hard drive as well. I'm going to be showing you how to transfer all the data over from your old hard drive onto the new hard drive. Um, so we're also going to be putting in 16 gigs of crucial RAM memory. So um, I'm pretty excited about that. And then, like I said, we're gonna be taking the CD drive out of that and putting it into my 2009 MacBook. So I got two different CD caddies. So pretty much what these do right here is they allow you to take out the CD drive and replace the CD optical drive with a hard drive. Um, so you can have two hard drives in your MacBook Pro, which is really exciting. So I got two different Two different caddies as you guys can see here. Um, I didn't know which one to get. This is the one that was rated for the mid-2012 uh, MacBook Pro, but this one said it, do, it, this one said it probably wouldn't work, but I've read uh, reviews and people have put this in there. So, um, so I'll, there'll be links to all of this down below, so anything that you guys are interested in getting, if you guys want to replicate this build or if you just want to check it out, I'm going to have links. Um, I ordered all this from Amazon, so I have Amazon links as well. And then I just got me a new little tool kit that's going to have all the right tools I'm going to need, uh, like the T7, um, T7 uh, screwdriver that you'll need to actually take out certain components. So uh, that's a little bit about what we're about to do. Um, so after this, uh, right about now, it's going to fade in and you'll be able to actually see all the different videos and you can click on which one you want to do or follow in step of the build that I'm doing. Um, so yeah, so what we're going to do is we're going to put all this into the computer. We're going to take the old CD drive, put it into the uh, old 2009 MacBook Pro. Um, the CD drive from here is going to go into here. And of course, I'm going to show you how to use their migration software so that you're able to uh, duplicate your hard drive from your actual computer that you're putting your SSD in there. So this will also work if you have an SSD and you don't want to do the CD drive caddy thing. You know, use one of these things to put your put your hard drive into. If you just wanted one hard drive, you know, you don't need these. These are just so I can have an extra hard drive in the MacBook Pro. So uh, enjoy the videos, guys. This is the first time that we've really started up Media Lock Tech, so I'm hoping it's uh, popular. Anyways, I'll catch you guys next time. Enjoy the videos.